There are lots of things people have missed in this pandemic, eating at local restaurants, shopping, and our everyday human interaction. But for Luca and Will, and many of our youth across Halton, it's sports they miss the most and are taking steps to do something about it by creating their Safe Sports campaign. Will and I are both student senators in the Halton District School Board Student Senate, and he really started to push for um, getting uh, sports back. That was something that he pushed for. And so uh, some working groups were created, just a few students to work on it. And that's how it started. And then uh, I joined in because I was also very passionate about the issue. And then it's uh, grown from there to a social media campaign. We're making the rounds on media, just trying to spread awareness. Uh, we have a few meetings with uh, trustees and superintendents lined up. Uh, so, it's, so it started small, but it's uh, definitely growing big, which is uh, very exciting. It's exciting, but for Will, it's also a necessity. Will plays football for Nelson Public High School in Burlington. However, he hasn't been able to play for a while. I'm actually in kind of a weird predicament. So uh, the officer rules, I switch schools going uh, grade 10 to grade 11. And if you switch schools, you have to take a year off of sports, right? So I missed out on all my sports in grade 11, and I missed out on all my sports in grade 12, and I'm returning uh, to hopefully play a little bit of football next year. So I'm, I'm really fighting for that because I haven't played high school football since grade 10. The campaign includes a petition currently circulating asking for signatures, but how would all this work? For Luca and Will, they say it would start slow. We know one day it's not going to be everything's locked down and the next day, you know, open the floodgates. So we're hoping we roll out the low contact sports like maybe track and field, like socially distanced and, you know, tennis and badminton and maybe swimming and stuff like that. All the things that are really easy to ensure that there's zero contact and stuff like that. Like, I think we could open up track tomorrow if it was warm outside. Um, and then, you know, as we build our confidence and kind of like a way to go about things with sports and stuff like that. We can get into soccer and baseball and stuff like that and work our way up. The key word again is safe. We want to make sure that when we do bring back sports, uh, that we are following, uh, you know, COVID guidelines, COVID protections to make sure it's safe for everybody. Because this, the big thing we care about is the health and well-being of students. The pair will be speaking before the Halton District School Board on March 17th in the hopes to convince the board to bring back sports. Because for Luca and Will, sports gives them meaning. I know that. Uh, just like everyone has been hard on me, suddenly being able to hang out with people and then not. I know I miss going to the gym, seeing my friends. Uh, so, so really sports uh, would help that and, and it would be a safe way to be with your friends and, and make uh, new friends and uh, new connections. I have gotten used to not playing sports a little bit since I was kind of already into it in grade 11. So it wasn't something I... but. I still got to practice. I still got to go to the gym with my friends and see all them and stuff like that. I'm lucky that I have a home gym, so at least I get a little bit of physical activity just to get your blood pumping and stuff like that. But I, it's like, again, it's starting to feel a little bit hopeless. Like I, I just want to play football and um, it feels like we're kind of in an endless loop, right? Reporting for Halton News, I'm Melissa Candelaria.